What's up? It's February 3rd, 2019 again. It's 1.38 and it's, uh, if you guys can see that, I don't think you can. 1.38 and it's 37 degrees outside. We have to go up to Sugarloaf. So we're going to take Sugarloaf to Moonloaf to Moon Ridge. So you guys can just see the snow discrepancies from down here on Highway 38 and this side of town. There's hardly anything. And then when we get up there, just a little bit of altitude, it'll be a lot more. So it's going to be cool, guys. Hope you enjoy. And a video I posted last night, I took an hour and 30 minutes to drive around, waste all, not waste that gas, but waste that gas essentially now. Um, and I didn't realize that playing the prodigy, that those bastards are such a bunch of snowflake pussies that they have their content blocked if somebody uses it. Like my, that whole video is blocked around the world. And like, dude, that was such a good video because that music is so rocking with some of the conditions I was in last night. Man, it was so perfect. But I'm trying to figure out a way to get that video going without sound. So maybe I can upload it that way. But um, yeah, I need, I need a little help with that. But anyway, we're on Barton Road, guys. This is the back way into Sugarloaf. You can see that way. There's not really any, not, not many clouds that way. But now as we head back into this direction of town, there'll be more clouds and more drizzle. We've been getting drizzle now. So yeah. And the further we go up this direction, the more snow we're gonna run into. So when we get up here to Maple, which is the main road up to Sugarloaf, but gets treacherous when it snows, because it's so steep, uh, we're gonna make a left here on Maple, so we're gonna continue on Maple then. And it looks like it's kind of snowing on the other side of town because the clouds have descended to the ground and it's just white so that's what's probably happening over there Yeah, back to the music thing, man. Like uh, in the old Napster days and and whatnot, when uh, Metallica and Lars Ulrich, them, they just got super pissed off because people were, you know, stealing stealing music off the internet and stuff. Look, I understand. Like I I understand. You know, you're a sellout, so you know people have to pay for your your music or else you're you're you know you're gonna cry. I understand. Um, but then I understand the point that you did work for it and that you don't deserve to be stolen from. But at the same time, it's just so irritating um, having these people rather others not listen to their music if they don't pay. Like, it's just sad. It's just really sad. So. Okay, and these people need to get out of the street because I am about to run them over. Should have run him over. Teach him a lesson. Don't be walking in the middle of the street, my friend. Okay, so we're on Barton heading up to, uh, gosh, what is the name of that road at the very end? Anyway, you, you take Barton, or uh, no, yeah, Barton. Wait, is this Barton? Yes, you take Barton to the very end to get to Moonloaf, and then you make a left. Guys, this is the shortcut into Moon Ridge. But if you don't have four wheel drive, a lot of times it can be a pain in the butt. Oh, yeah, you can see the clouds are getting thicker over here. It's supposed to start snowing about four or five o'clock. So hopefully we get that. Oh shit. Oh shit. 
going a little too fast on this ice right here. I can't believe I just made the turn. Oh, look at these guys lagging, really? Dude, I was behind that guy earlier, that's so funny. And he was driving like such a Barney. You know what, I wonder if I can make it up this way. Should I try? No, that looks too gnarly, there's no way. No, nope, I did it in my Mercedes ML once. Anyway. The first time we've actually seen a bunch of cars on here, huh? And if you go over this edge right here, that kind of sucks because you go all the way down there. So funny seeing these big trucks just taking their taking their sweet time, lifted. Just Barney's. Oh man. All right, 34 degrees up here. I'm hoping. We might even get a little bit of snow on the way down. That'd be kind of cool. Yeah, oh my gosh, come on, you Barney. so you guys can see out. Oh yeah. See out there. there. Alright, so maybe double the length of this video will be home. too bad you guys especially since we had these slow pokes in front of us we would have been way way done way sooner I've always wondered if these lifted trucks are to make up for a small dick or something damn it I cussed again sorry about that I've always wondered that or maybe I'm just jealous because I, I, I can't afford a big truck <laughs> that's probably more like it but talking smack every once in a while, you know? Ain't gonna kill anybody. Um, and I, I like to joke with um, my good friend Gabriel about his, he has a truck that's like almost twice as lifted as that. The guy is cool as hell, but we're not gonna follow these jerk offs. Yeah, so we're in Upper Moon Ridge, guys. Temperature is 34 degrees and 1.48 p.m. in Upper Moon Ridge. Gosh, 
gosh, you know what I'm craving? In and out. I'd like to drive down the hill right now to go grab some some in and out, but I know traffic coming back up would be a nightmare. Just a nightmare. But look at how much more snow they have up here. So significantly different. Obviously, they still have a bunch of dry dry patches up here, but they got a lot more snow up here. closer we go this direction closer to the mountain the more snow we'll get as part of the orographic lift okay wow it is so pretty right now the sun's popping through right there wow Street was called Columbine. To drive down Columbine, you need to carry some guns. Oh, that, it's not too soon. That was a long time ago. And as a matter of fact, I lived in in Denver, Colorado, for two years. The two years, uh, about six months prior to those two kids uh, shooting up the school. That was the first major school shooting, um, if I recall. They were they were part of what was called the trench coat mafia. And when I lived in, in Denver, Colorado, I went to a boarding school and a couple of the kids there, you know, were part of the trench coat mafia gang. <laughs> you know, it was just so lame. But they ended up doing something so stupid and devastating. And honestly, dude, if you do something like that, you deserve to die. So I'm, I'm glad they're dead. Glad they're dead. All right. So that's bear over there. These houses have the most incredible view, you guys. Man, they really do. Alright, so I just saw the drive. Okay, let's see. Well, the other driveway had better marks to be able to tell how much snow fell. It looked like about three inches up here, three and a half inches. I know I could afford one of these homes to rent up here, but the only issue is that if my business goes south, then I wouldn't be able to afford it anymore. Oh man, this is a bummer. All right, cool, here we go. Let's be very careful right here, this is super steep. And is that a snowflake I just saw fall from the sky? Nope, it's just rain drizzle, not a snowflake. It's still 34 degrees. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, just one doggone minute. So this is where I like to take you guys to go sledding in here because you can sled in this whole center part and it goes up and down both sides. And you don't have to worry about any cars. This is where I always tell you guys I like to take you when we have good snow. And I've brought a few of you up here. When you, when you hit me up, I uh, have you guys meet me somewhere and I have you follow me over here and, I, and then I take you right here. So you guys can sled right there. The whole middle part of, the, of this neighborhood is a big gully. And when we get okay snow, both sides are completely packed with snow and it's just nonstop fun. So anyway. Oh shit. Alright, got a little loose there, that's okay. So we're on sheep horn right now. And it appears. Okay, what kind of weather are we getting right here? We're getting a little. Oh shit, we're getting a little snow and drizzle. Let's see. 
So as we get closer to bear, we're starting to get some drizzle. And it actually looks like we're getting some snowflakes mixed in, little tiny, little baby snowflakes mixed in with the rain. So that's cool. Yep, it is. Definitely is. Very cool. Get this video uploaded, then I gotta go make another one. <laughs> well, I love you guys, man. This really, really makes me happy doing this for you guys. has more snow on it now look people are out there trying to sled it's hard to sled on flat ground though I gotta say but it's fun to make snowmen over there <laughs> all right so we just took we just came from Bear City to Sugarloaf through Moon Ridge or to Moonloaf to Moon Ridge and then back back in Moonridge now so I'm gonna shut off the video and uh, it will upload shortly and as soon as it starts snowing more I will be recording that as you know peace out I hope you guys have a great day and uh, yeah it's not two feet of snow it's two inches peace out <laughs>